Hi everyone, this is Dr. Ronnie, and I am here with my video series, 10 Ways in 10 Days. This is episode number seven. Um, in case you missed my previous episodes, I talked about um, nutrients for eye health, meaning the best foods that you can have to promote your vision health. I talked about UV protection, uh, blue light, blue light blocking glasses. I talked about um, other ways to block blue light, for example, screen filter apps and smart bulbs. I talked about digital eye strain and what you can do to prevent against dis digital eye strain. And I also talked about the importance of hydration and how you can know if you're drinking enough fluids every day. So this is episode number seven and I'm going to be talking about another important way you can protect your vision health as well as your general health, and that is movement. Now, uh, movement is just so important for our health. It gets our blood pumping, it gets our, our uh, blood circulating, getting oxygen to vital tissues. Um, it helps to provide nutrients to our cells. It helps to detoxify. Now, movement means different things to different people. Um, I also wanna just point out that you no notice that I said movement and not exercise, and there's a reason for that. The reason I don't like to use the term exercise is because exercise can be intimidating for some people. For, um, especially if they're, um, depending on their prior fitness level, if they have any pre-existing medical conditions, uh, many people may not feel comfortable saying that they're gonna embark on exercise. So I like to use the word movement instead. And movement means different things to different people. So for example, for some people, it may mean simply getting up and walking, or going upstairs or going downstairs. For other people, it may be, uh, movement may mean sitting and doing stretching, uh, doing some chair yoga, for example or it may simply mean breathing exercises. That can be movement as well. But for other people who are more aerobically inclined, it may mean, mean running or swimming or biking or perhaps something even more aerobic like a high intensity workout. But basically, try to incorporate some amount of movement into your daily routine or perhaps several times into your daily routine. So many of us have sedentary lifestyles. Many of us are sitting at a computer for hours at a day, myself included. But if that that's the case, um, set your timer and every hour make it a point to get up and move. Again, you can just take a walk around your office or around your house. You can just simply just sit and rotate your wrists, rotate your, your um, uh, ankles, uh, stretch, flex and, and extend your feet. Um, that is movement as well. So make it a point to make movement part of your daily routine. Your your body will thank you for your for it and your eyes will thank you for it as well so that is um my uh my my tip for uh, my seventh tip in this video series uh 10 ways in 10 days i hope you enjoyed this remember to like it and also comment below and stay tuned for my next video episode number eight